Hi there, viewers and gamers alike out there, and welcome back for more of Legend of Zelda Link to the Past. So, this is part two, and I got some bombs when I opened up a chest. 20 rupees. 20 rupees. 20 rupees. There is a heart piece in this. There's a few places around here you can find heart pieces in Kakariko Village. Heart piece! That's two! Okay, you can collect a maximum of ten bombs if you want to know. So, that is a lot of bombs. Oh, don't go near the people, the uh, people who are trying to search for you because you are like the most wanted criminal in all of Hyrule for kidnapping Princess Zelda, so uh, I suggest you do not go talk to them. But you can talk to this guy! You sir, have you been going through life without one of my whole anything bottles? Well, step right up and make your life complete. I've got one on sale now for the low, low price of 100 rupees. Yes, sir, my good Sir, what do you say? Interested? Goodbye. Thanks a lot. Now, hold it above your head for the whole world to see, okay? It's good for business. This is a magic bottle. You can store an item inside and then use it later. I'm all sold out of bottles. Come back later, okay? Um, I can't come back later because you don't have any more. A low, low price of a hundred rupees. Yo, Leo! This house used to be a hideout for a gang of thieves. What was their leader's name? Oh yeah, his name was Blind and he hated bright light a lot. That is a bo Easter egg boss that is going to be on this game, if you want to know. That is a, a crack in the wall. Break it down with a bomb. Break it down, break it down with a bomb. <laughs> oh man. I kinda I I gotta remember what is the exact proper way to open up. Nope. <laughs> no. Oh, now I remember. I, okay. I couldn't remember the exact way to open up. Silly me, I just... Yeah, there it is. Uh-huh. Funny. And right here in this little area, a secret area, is another heart piece. Ta-da! Remember, you gotta pay attention to these videos to know the location of the heart pieces. So there's like several heart pieces in Kakariko Village. All right. I already talked to the elderly woman, and that uh, that is marked on my map. But that is not where we're gonna find. Looks like a bird statue. I am almost out of bombs. Most of Kakariko Village trust me. If you want to know. Alright, I'm down to one last bomb. Oh, if you think there's nothing there, watch. You'll see. And... There we go! 
A secret shed. Two bombs. Three bombs. Four bombs. Plus five arrows. Oh no. Yay! Extra bomb! Hi, Leo. Elder, are you talking about the ma about the grandpa? Okay, but don't tell any of the bad people about this. He's hiding in the palace past the castle. I'll mark the spot on your map. Here you are. Way over there. The Eastern Palace. Well, at least some people do trust me. Alright. By the way, if you try to stand near one of your own bombs, you will take damage. So, I suggest you do not try to stand near, or your, uh, near quite of your own bombs. Yeah, go ahead and run away. There is a magic bottle here. See? No, I, I have no idea who owns this place. And we are going to talk to that bug catching, a uh, bug neck catching kid right there. However, he has the flu and couldn't get up. I can't go out because I'm sick. <coughs> People say I caught this cold from that evil air that is coming down off the mountain. <coughs> this is my bug catching net. I'll use it when I'm better. But for now, I'll lend it to you. You got borrowed the bug catching net. There are many there may be some other things you can catch with it, too. Get well soon. I hope he's going to be fine. Wow, someone's lawn is overgrown. Uh-huh. An interesting story, huh? That is a very interesting story. Zora's River! I would love to go visit! Okay. Mumble, mumble. My son really liked playing to play the flute, but he went to look for the golden power has not returned. Wonder where he is and what he's doing. Whoa! I saw a very nice young lady at the waterfall of wishing in the hills where the river begins. Leo, you should meet her at least once. I'm sure you will like her. Uh, thanks. If I ever get the chance. <sighs> that is the smithy. <laughs> I destroyed it. Let's see, that is the library. Hey, I can climb back up and do it again. See? Whee! <laughs> mm. Woo! Um, what? What did you do? Yeah, Leo, I'm, now I'm quarreling with my younger brother. I sealed the door to his room. So the door is open again. Okay, okay, maybe I should make up with my brother. Hey, Leo, did you come from the, my older brother's room? Is he still angry? Um, I don't know. Maybe you should go talk to him yourself. 
Okay. You can reach the goal within 15 seconds, we'll give you something good. Okay, made it! 10 seconds. Zero hours, zero minutes, 10 seconds. I qualified! A piece of art! Ta-da! Now I'm full, now I'm at five hearts! Awesome sauce! Alright. That is where you open treasures. It's like a mini game. They'll find which is the biggest treasure to open up. You'll have to guess which one it is if you want to know, so no cheating. And no, there is no lens of truth, okay? So it's not possible. Haha! Uh -huh. You can fire that many arrows, but it will do you no good. It's too bad for you. You could have lasted longer. Haha! <laughs> Loser. So, part two is the search for the el the the search for the elder is the name of the episode. Or. Or the road to the East Palace, if you want to know. Whichever works. If you want to know what or wonder what I'm doing, I am Al Creep. Ah! Uh, all right, take it, thief. Okay, yeah. Way to go. Not thiefy boy. That is the big fairy fountain. And no, I cannot swim. That would have been awesome, but does this look like I can swim? No. Okay, so we're just on uh, uh, this episode is called free roaming. So we're free roaming around all of Hyrule until we go to the East Palace. That is. All right. Nice try. You lose. I don't have a specific item that will not let me. If you think I'm going to go to the desert palace, I'm not. Because that is not my intention. Beat it, vulture! Alright. Yeah, well, I'm going to rename this episode, uh, Free Ro uh, Roaming Around Hyrule is the name of the episode. I am Agina. I sent... Okay, I am Agina. I sense something is happening in the Golden Land, the Seven Wise Men Seal. This must be an omen of the Great Cataclysm foretold by the people of Hylian Blood. The prophecy says the hero will stand in the desert holding the Book of Mudora. If you have the Book of Mudora, you can read the language of the Hylia people. Should be in the house of the books in the village. You must get it if you are the person who will be the hero. Here's another heart piece. Right here. Ta-da! Another heart piece. I'm good or what? This is why I want to, this is why I'm gonna show you guys where the heart piece locations are at. Down 
we go. Escaping from the desert. We are good to go. Ooh, beat it. Boy, I got a sword and I'm not afraid to use it. Hmm, this. Okay, we are going to pull that releases the water from this type of reservoir, I don't know, like a watering hole. And there we have it. A heart piece right there. Magic fish. Wow, some magic fish. Whoa! Those Octoroks really don't like me. I am going to get the Ice Rod. I'm not going to fall in because the only way to cross on to the other side is to go this way. Great. Worm creatures. Or sand crawlers. Star Wars reference. Take some rupees, but don't tell anyone I gave them to you. Keep it between us, okay? 300! Bombs! Ta-da! 578! That is a lot of rupees! Ow! Yeah, those, uh, clap traps take you- take two hearts away from you and it's not very nice. Octo balloons. Ha! <laughs> Blocked it. Let's see. Ah. Bingo! And there it is! The Ice Rod! It's Chill Magic... It's Chill Magic Blast... The... It's Chill Magic Blast the Air. But watch your magic meter! There is no way for me to go on that side. If you think I'm going to that from one so, one part of that side, this was an ice cavern with fairies. Put a bomb there and opens up. Ta-da! Ooh, let's capture one. And if if I pass out, um, if all my hearts are gone, I will be completely come back to life. But I do believe we are going to stop here for the time being, and don't worry, we are going to continue to pick up from where we left off, and thanks for watching. And don't forget to like, comment, favorite, and subscribe, and tell me what do you guys think of Legend of Zelda Link to the Past. Because this game is indefinitely in the top 50. 
So for anyways, this is Leo Wolverine saying and speaking as always as your sensational special being who takes chances, makes mistakes, and get messy in Leo's Let's Plays Alliance. Godspeed, play safe, and shalom. Remember, always fight with love, honor, truth, and justice.